Hello Taurus, welcome to your March reading. This is Catherine, formerly of Twin Flame Mystique 1111. We are now to Spirit Tarot. All right, so I'm going to start off with uh, your crowning energy. Let me pull a couple of cards here. And let's see where you are mentally. Let's see where you are uh, emotionally, okay? Let's see what, what you got going on. All right. Okay, four springs. Yes. I love the springtime. Be grateful. You have much to celebrate. Deep feelings of peace and happiness. A contented personal life. Yes, yes and yes. This is absolutely right. This is absolutely what spring does for us. It helps us move forward and feel rejuvenated and feel brand new again, okay? Because here in spring, we are now starting to reap the rewards of what we have, what seeds we have planted in these last few seasons, okay? sun is out now and it is giving life it is birthing life into what you have sown and here you are life experience okay let go of belief systems that no longer work for you an important life changing event and a situation that leads to significant opportunities this is fantastic Look at this card. I love the illustration. Look at that ahead. It looks like it's a mystery, but it's actually your heaven on earth. What do you want to, that to look like, huh? All right. I'm going to pull a few clarifying cards there on letting go of our belief systems that no longer work for you. Okay. This is so true. It is so true because as you enlightened, you've got to let go of all your social conditioning because that life is over. It's over. That's now your past life. Now you have your true life. You're in your passions. You're in your life purpose, right? So it will make sense to still be crying about what's in the past, right? Sensical, nonsensical, don't make sense. Not especially since you have here spring, right? Flowers are in bloom. Beautiful. All right, let me get a clarifying card for you. Let's see, how much to deal? Yeah, see, look, that is what you were having to let go of. This is a validation. Let it go. You're doing that to yourself. If you can't let anything go, you're doing it to yourself. All right? Your heaven on earth is up to you. So what you want? Let's clarify that again. And that's having to do with your emotions. Look, today being the new moon and being new moon in Pisces season, okay? It can be a little difficult because Pisces is about our emotions, right? And as we come into spring, okay, and we can't enjoy the beauty of all that we have sown, all of these seeds. We can't enjoy the, um, the birth of something beautiful, right? If you're still here, boohooing and crying and and all about the past, it just don't make sense. It doesn't make sense. So, all right, let me pull a card here. Yeah, look. In all of this rebirth, you're here as King of Wands. King of Wands, all right? You're here taking action in 
this spring season and this new season of your life in your self-love and your self-worth. See all the green in there? That is corresponding to a heart chakra. You're in your self-love, you're in your self-worth. Okay, you're there resilient. You're there in your intuitiveness, in your grace. That's who you are. That's who you are, not this. Not this, you were never meant for this. That was just life happening around you. And that life is over. It's done. Time to pay it forward. Tell your story. That's it. You pay it forward. You tell your story to help the next one. But it is no longer who you are. It never was. It never was. That's what you wake up to. That it never was who you were. You were just here playing a role, honey. You were playing a role, and now you're woke. Now you're woke. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's pull another card. Okay. So, now, here with this card, you were waiting. You were waiting for something to, to, um, to be over and done with. Okay? And it's done. It's done. So, any of you having any legal issues? Any of you? This judgment card is telling me it's all in your favor. It's all in your favor. Because you're here in gratitude. Alright? Time to celebrate. It's all in your favor. Don't put no mind to it. Don't, because the mind does not feel. It does not feel. Your heart does. Your love does. You want it to be over? You want to have this victory? It's already done. You're just needing to catch up to it, honey. That's it. You just need to catch up to that truth. Let's clarify that. Oh, yes. Beautiful. Look, all your cups are full here. All of them. And this is how I read. I read intuitively. Beautiful. You have all of this beauty. It's time. It's time for you to enjoy your heaven on earth life as it should be, right? Not needing for anything because you've always had everything that you need and you want. You just had to wake up and open your eyes to see it. Okay? That's all it was. Now that you woke, that's all it was. And your gratitude will help you stay in an enlightened compassion for yourself and those around you that are not meant to wake up, okay? And you can't blame that for it. You can't blame them for that, all right? You just have to kindly say, I love you, I have gratitude for everything that I have learned, good or bad. And that allowed you to wake up. They allowed you to wake up. Okay, and then from there, you just go with your flow and trust in your inner guidance because you're never alone. Your inner guidance, your soul, your spark of the divinity is always bringing you messages from your guides, from your ancestors. Right? Always. These days are over, look. These days are over. Okay? That's over. No more crying over spilt wine. Okay? If you just, look, those of you still having problems, just turn around. Just turn around. And look what you have behind you. Look what you have right beside you. 
it's always been there. Those cups have always been there, full of love. Full of love, ready for you to, to move on and have a beautiful life. Alright, let's clarify that. <clears throat> okay. Now I'm going to say this is having to do with the judgment card. This next one that I've pulled. Okay. And get ready. Because as you say yes to your to your now beautiful life, to all the blessings in your gratitude, okay? Things are going to happen real fast. It's going to happen real fast. And all you're just going to have to know to say is just thank you. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, universe. Thank you, guides and ancestors. Because you've said yes to your path. And that is to assist unity consciousness. Because you're it. You're it. You know, you hear that saying. You're always hearing people. Well, you want to see the change in the world? you got to be the change. Yes. Yes. And yes. Why? Because you are love. Being spark of divinity, you are love. And love is patient. And love is kind. It always protects. You can always trust it. Love always hopes. And love always perseveres. And that's all you need to know. That's all you need to know when you wake up and you thank the sun and you thank that spark of divinity in you for allowing you another day to learn, to teach, to reflect, to be happy, and to be that change. All right, Taurus, that was beautiful, beautiful message. I love connecting with y'all. I am a Taurus sun. So this is our energy in the Pisces season in this new moon. Okay? This is our energy. That is the grounded Taurian energy. If you can't see it, it's because you need to feel it. Okay? All right, I'm going to leave it right there. I will talk to y'all later. Have a blessed and beautiful, beautiful day. Please like and subscribe. And again, I am of the Twin Flame Mystique 1111 formerly, and we are now to Spirit Tarot.